welcome back to another video. Today's video is going to be an everyday summer makeup tutorial. Now, this tutorial is a, a look that I have been really, really loving and been wearing throughout the summertime. And I really, really like it. I've had a lot of compliments on it. I've been wearing it sometimes to work, sometimes just out, and also... I, be, I always wear this look to church. That's like the number one place I wear this look at. And I really like it. Love, look it. Like it. I really like it. It's one of those looks that is like my newest go-to. And the palettes that I use will be listed below. If I don't mention any other products in the tutorial, then it will be listed in the description box. So please go down there that did not turn out or sound right but go check down below and yeah if you are new the subscribe button is here if you're on a mobile device and if you're on a desktop device it'll be listed here and right here as well on the screen so also I have two other websites that you can check out and they are my blog which is makeup by Diana D dot com it'll be listed in the description and also which is my vlog, which is my everyday life. It'll also be listed in the description, which is a day with D. But this is my everyday look, including lip balm, everything, and etc. So this is like everyday type look. I plan on doing everyday makeup struggles. If you guys don't want to see an everyday makeup struggles video, then comment below everyday makeup struggles. But here is what I've been wearing for the past couple of weeks during this whole summer month. Okay guys, here we go. Alright everyone, this look I have been wearing the whole summer so far. And I'm going to be taking a Beauty Cheese palette and I'm going to take that brown shade and I'm going to apply it to the crease. We're going to be using a couple of different brown shades so don't think this is going to be my main shade of choice but this is a shade that I have been using for the longest and I love it. Then I'm going in the shade next to the brown that's a really like deep brown. It's like a dark deep brown but it's very gorgeous and I love it. <laughs> going in with that shade I'm going to be applying it right up under the first shade that we applied. Going in with the deeper color again, I'm just going to kind of like blend it also in the outer V because if you want a everyday look, you want to kind of mix and match colors and it's kind of okay to mix and match colors and it makes the look a lot fun. So that's what I like and I'm also going to bring in the inner corner as well. Taking that pretty green, I'm going to apply it right above the outer V and I'm starting at the very beginning of the ending of our lid and I'm going to make sure I really apply as much as needed and I'm going to take that beautiful, beautiful color that I just used and I'm going to apply it to the lid. It's like a bronze color and I just love it so much. And it kind of screams summer, that's why I'm like using this palette and also that shade for that palette because it's gorgeous and then I'm going to take the nice shade here it's like a matte vanilla shade as a brow bone highlight and then I'm going to make sure I blend it down towards the crease colors that we used
same colors that I used in the crease and the eye as well. I'm going to take them besides the bridal highlight and apply it to the lower lash line. Taking Diamond Cosmetics Eyeliner in Black. I have been using this non-stop, you guys. It's crazy, but I've been using it non-stop. And I'm going to take it to Maybelline Falsies. I love Maybelline Falsies Mascara because it makes my lashes look like I have on lash extensions. But it really does. But I really doesn't, and I love it so much. with you guys my highlighting routine and I've already applied my foundation I do have a review to be linked below but this is basically my concealer highlighting routine but if I don't apply concealer then I will use like powder as my concealer and I'm using the Iman Cosmetics powder and I'm going to use that as the concealer vibe look it works just amazing and I'm also going to use on top of it Maybelline the false Maybelline, <laughs> I'm about to say falsies, Maybelline Superstay, and I'm gonna apply that on top of it as well because I love that look of a nice concealed look, but it's not concealer, it's powder. But if you guys want me to do a video on that, I will do so. If you guys just let me know in the comments below. And I'm about to hit pan, yep, that's the face of a hit pan. And I'm going to take that and set it. That's like my whole face. I'm going to set it. And I'm going to set it with a BH Cosmetics brush. And then after that, I am going to be taking is a MAC 102 brush. This is a fake brush, by the way. I got off of eBay. And I'm just going to take it with and use it the Wet n Wild Mega Glow. And use that as my highlighter. Because, you know, you got to have that glow. You got to have that on fleekness. that you guys enjoyed this video give this video a massive thumbs up and i hope that you guys check out all my social media which will be also linked in the description box and i gotta go and i will see you soon bye